Hello everyone, welcome to our channel CodeSRK. In this session, I will be telling you how maths and coding are related to each other. Before starting this session, I would like to request you people to please like and share our videos and also subscribe to our channel Coders Arcade and press the bell icon so that you receive notifications regarding our latest updates and you do not miss out on our future uploads. Thank you. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. As I said earlier, today's topic is how coding and mathematics are related to each other. As we know, many teachers face a hard challenge when teaching their students maths. It is very common to witness kids in classrooms all over the globe that appear to be allergic to maths, formulas, algorithms and equations. Educational institutions are constantly trying to find new engaging ways to teach maths to their students but without success. Therefore, we try to be a light of hope for those teachers or students and let them know there is an amazing possibility to make their students understand that mathematics isn't only a practical tool they can use every day, but it is also engaging and at the same time fun. One of the many reasons that inspired us to start our YouTube channel was to offer students practical tools and ways to use science, technology, engineering and maths. But this last field has always been a bit more problematic. That is exactly why we wondered how we can motivate our students to appreciate maths and to understand it in a smoother, easier way. The answer to that how is very simple. It's coding. Maths and coding are deeply related and when teaching students how to code, we are simultaneously delivering mathematical content and a way of thinking that they can use later on while calculating something specific in their maths class. It gets better because students will acquire these mathematical skills and abilities without even noticing it and while having a lot of fun. So, are you ready to hear how related these fields are and how can coding help students fall in love with mathematics? Okay then, here we go. Coding can help students love mathematics. Believe it or not, coding is full of maths. When kids participate in a coding competition or when they learn how to write their own code or program, they are actually applying principles that belong to mathematics and developing strong mathematical thinking that will help them in many areas of their academic and personal life. At the end of the day, the secret ingredient of the engaging formula is to make maths a field that is closer to your students' interests and goals, and to show them hands-on how these concepts can be applied in reality. The kids of today want to learn things in a different way, Coding, on the other hand, offers students practical and fun approaches to mathematics and technology, forcing them in a very natural way to discover what is the best to make their very own code to do a specific task or complete a certain mission. Coding is maths or maths is coding. This is true. Coding at the bottom line is maths. In order to write a line of code, that works well and that is completely bug free, coders need to strengthen their algorithmic thinking and computational thinking. And what are these two ways of thinking in their deepest essence? These are maths. At the end of the day, if you want to learn a great programming language, your mathematical thinking should be performing well enough for you to succeed. Therefore, we can say that Mathematics will help you to take yourself to a very higher level in programming or coding. And we have a very good news. And the good news is students can strengthen their mathematical thinking the opposite way around. They don't have to begin with maths to progress to coding. They can actually start coding and in the way get way better in maths 
and even highlighting in your maths evaluations. It will definitely help you in your academic curriculum and also in your daily life. So, why not start offering yourself a new way of thinking? Experience maths in a hands-on, dynamic and engaging format and be amazed by the results you will see in your class. Give it a try. And the reason why I stress this is because of only one reason. Because maths is coding and coding is maths. Or simply put, coding and maths are the two sides of a coin. So this will be the introduction to our playlist. Here we will be learning about many basic concepts which people find difficult to understand. And I guarantee you, you will be having fun while at the same time you will be learning very interesting topics and which will help you to become good in mathematics and at the same time which will help you to secure even good marks, even better marks in your academics. So thank you. See you guys in the future videos of this playlist. Happy learning. Bye-bye.